what is the cracking, what is the pop when somebody uh, pops their knuckles, if they pop their own neck, or especially if a chiropractor cracks your back. Uh, to understand what that noise is, where it's coming from, you need to know a little bit about the joint. You need to know three things about the joint. So, because that's where the noise comes from. That's where that popping comes from. It comes from inside of a joint. So in this video, I am going to educate you a little bit on the three or four main components of a joint and then let you know, here's what's happening within that joint making that noise. When two bone surfaces, pretend this is a bone, pretend this is a bone. When two bone surfaces come together, creates a joint. You got your joint right here. On each end of the bone, you've got this cartilage material. It's nice and smooth. It creates a nice smooth surface in through here. And that is what allows us to move. Without joints, we would be one block of bone and we wouldn't be able to move. And we have lots of these joints everywhere. We have them all along our spine too. So we've got the joint, or I'm sorry, we've got the bone and we have the cartilage surface within the space in between these two joints we've got a fluid it's not quite like water um, it's not oil but it's a more it's a very slippery uh, substance and it's called synovial fluid so this really slippery substance is a, what allows a nice smooth gliding movement in through there and then uh, all around the joint surrounding the joint we have something called a capsule and we have ligaments and that's what holds the joints nice and tightly in place so that they can't fall apart. Um, so now you have the main components, the understanding so that we can describe and you can really know what's happening inside the joint making that popping noise. So, so we got those joints. If we pull them apart, because we've got those ligaments and those capsules on there holding it in place, when we pull it apart, and especially when you, when you do it kind of quick, when you pull it apart quickly, there is a negative pressure. It's kind of like a, val a vacuum. It takes pressure uh, out of the synovial fluid and gases are drawn out, or a gas. A gas is drawn out of that synovial fluid and it creates a cavity. It creates a space and they actually call it a cavitation when that space is created and out of that, at that moment that that gas is drawn out of the synovial fluid, that is what creates that popping noise. And again, it's called the cavity. So if I were to take my hands here, and it's not quite like this, but just to give you an example, and what I'm gonna try to do is get all of the air out, hold my hands close together and pull that out. And you just hear a little, a little pop right in there. So that's kind of what's happening. You've got this confined space. We pull something uh, apart quickly, pulls that gas out, and you got your pop. So that is what the pop is. It's not dangerous by any means, and for a lot of people, they find it to be kind of therapeutic. It feels good uh, to have an adjustment done. So I love answering questions. If you have questions, if you want to know more, uh, leave me a comment below, and I'd be more than happy to answer your questions for you.